This video is going to demonstrate how to organize your slides so that they look attractive. If you look at these slides, I've already set them up. I've added text to explain what the images are on every single one. The only one I haven't done is the first slide so that I can demonstrate how I set that up. The first thing that I'm going to want to do is select an image and hold the shift key on that top row. Then I'll go to the format option at the top. I'll go to the alignment and I'll choose along the top or I could choose along the bottom. Then I want to go to the bottom row and do the same. Now you don't have to do this. I like things to be really orderly and that's why I use the alignment tool. So I'm going to go back to the format alignment tool and I'll choose along the bottom. Another thing I'm going to do is go back to that alignment and I'm going to say distribute horizontally so they're equally distanced apart. I'll do that on the top row, holding down the shift key to grab all three and then I will choose distribute horizontally. So that is something you can do with the alignment tool. As you look at this slide, I've even done it with my text boxes. Everything is aligned nicely and I pretty much made the images roughly the same size on each slide as well. So now I'm going to go ahead and add the text so that my audience knows what each image represents. So I'll click on insert and what I chose was the shape and I chose the following shape to add my text. I drug it out and I just so happened to like that color so I left it and then you can add your text. You can start typing. So I would put um, Italian food. And what I did is I selected the text box. Let's go back and see how I set that up. You can see that I even changed the color of the text. So I set that to Georgia size 20. So what I did came in. I right click and I chose Georgia. I typed in Georgia for my font. Hit the enter key size 20. And then I changed the text color to a light orange to match my color scheme. Then I did control C. I selected that text box. I did control C for copy, control V, so that I had the exact same shape. I know I'm into really consistency. Some kids will have different shapes. That's fine as long as it looks good, but I'm going to keep consistent. So then I would change this to Chinese food. I would then paste again, control V, and then this is going to be Mexican food. And then what I did is I held the shift key down to select all three of those boxes. I went to the format. I went to align along bottom. I also went back to the align and I distribute horizontally. And then with those selected I did control C for copy and then control V for paste. And then I just come down with those text boxes and replace that text with the, with the food that it is. So that's how I set up the text boxes on all these slides and it looks really good and it looks organized. Until next time, I hope this video has been helpful. You have a fabulous day.